So guys, what's going on? Static Leo here. So today we got a few parts. We got some new headlights, fog lights. Some I got some new keys for the for the fog lights as well, and some new switchbacks. And this is to seal the headlights because I'm gonna be sealing them that way they don't get wet. Shout out to my boy Elegant Flaco for coming through with this. But as you can see, they're wet. And these kind of lasted a while because I changed these headlights like in April of last year. So they lasted quite a while. And I'm also going to be changing these because these are like the old style ones. The ones that shift between white and orange. And I got the other ones. The ones that turn to orange when you turn the blinker on. So I'm going to be changing those. I'm going to be changing the fog lights. As you can see, they're kind of old. I got these fog lights like, shit, like almost two years ago. So these are already old. Also, as you can see, the LEDs, they don't look too great either. They're also, this is the other one. And then over here on the inside, you can see right there that it's broken. So yeah, I got those new. I got those new and I got the fog lights new. And as you can see, these shift between the colors. So I don't really like that. It's because I got these when they first came out. And then the other ones came out after. I also got these like two years ago. So I've had those for a while. I also had resistors, so it wouldn't flash fast like that, but I don't know what happened. I guess they're not working anymore. So I'm gonna have to go over to HID kits or something to get a new one. So yeah, both sides are doing that. So I'm gonna have to go over to HID kits and get two new ones. Get them to install it. But I'll just go later on. Also guys, there isn't going to be any more chrome on the truck. Well, this is all the chrome that I have on it, these two pieces. But I'm going to be brushing them. So we're going to have like a brushed silver right here. And then a brushed silver over here. And I think it's going to look good. It's going to look good with the wheels since they're brushed silver. So yeah, we're going to be taking care of that today as well. I also wanted to give you guys an update on my bed. Because I know I said I was supposed to get my fuel cell done last Sunday. But for those of you that live in Houston, you know that it's been raining a lot. So on Sunday, we weren't able to do it because it was raining. And the guy that's going to do it, he, he works outside. But this Sunday, we're going to be doing my fuel cell. He's going to be relocating my shocks. He's going to put them straight down so I can get a smoother ride. And he's going to be doing my tubs. So in this video, I want you guys to comment because I'm not sure about my doghouse yet. I want you to comment if I should get a round doghouse or a squared one because I'm still debating about that. So yeah, on Sunday, we're going to do that. So y'all stay tuned for that video. And then that following Thursday, I'm going to take it to RA Customs and they're going to redo my bed liner. So it's going to look nice and white. So the bed is going to look really nice. It's going to be done. And I'm really excited to finally get this done. Because I know the truck is going to look much cleaner. And now let's get all this stuff out of the boxes. And get to installing them. Alright so before anything we're going to take these out. Because we're going to seal them while. We're going to seal them before we do anything else. That way they can be drying. So let's take these out. So here they are, the new ones. And actually, it looks like they're already pretty sealed. As you can see, it looks like they have plenty of silicone already in there. So I don't think we're going to have to seal them, to be honest. So we're going to put that aside. And then we have the other one.
and this one too like it has a lot of silicone so i don't think i'm gonna have to reseal them it's even sticky still so i think we should be good we should be good to just put them on and then here we have the big ones these don't really give any issues they don't really ever fog up but these are really sealed as well so these should be fine but i think the headlights should be fine we don't really have to do anything to them we can just install them like that need these for the fog lights so we're gonna open these these for the fog lights the new ones that I got and I got the four-sided ones as you can see because these are brighter and these I'll have the link to everything in the description for those of you that want to get this so these are the LEDs and then I think that these are the switchbacks So these are the switchbacks right here, the new ones. And then right here we have the new fog lights. We got the new fog lights right here. everything right here so we're gonna move on to the truck and we're gonna install these so we're gonna start with the headlights and then we're gonna do the fog lights at the end and then we're gonna get to brushing all that stuff
Alright, so now that we got those on, we're gonna go ahead and change the fog lights since I have easier access there without the grill on. These new LEDs for the fog lights, they don't even work. Like the plug's not even the same and they don't even go in. So I'm gonna have to use the same old ones. Hopefully they look better since the fog light is gonna be new. All right, so as you can see, they actually do look a lot better. They look clear compared to these. So I'm gonna change this one and then we're gonna get the front end put all back together. Alright guys, so it's already dark time because I had to go pick up my brother from work, so I had to go. But I got both of the fog lights on now. And he's over here helping me tape. He's taping the door handle because we're getting ready to brush it. And he already did the mirror. And I already did like a little test right here. But I'm going to do it more than that. So we're going to be using a scotch bright and we're just gonna brush it and it should come out good and same over here so i'm gonna get this front end put back together and then we're gonna move on to doing the the mirror caps and the door handles Alright guys, so the headlights are on. It looks much better. Put the emergencies. And then those are the switchbacks. So yeah, now we're gonna move on to brushing the chrome accents. Alright, so to brush chrome, you're gonna take a scotch break. I'm just gonna rub it. Uh, I'm gonna do it, you gotta do it in the same direction. That way you can all look the same. So you just start going like that. Start going like that, like that. All evenly. In the same direction. Like this. Until you get it where you want to. So I'll show you guys when I'm done. Alright guys, so this is how it looks brushed. It matches the wheels. As you can see, the wheels are brushed as well. I'm gonna see how it looks tomorrow in the day. And if it needs more, I'll just give it a little more. But I like how it looks right there. So now I'm gonna move on to the door handle. And I'm just gonna go from here to here. So I'll show you guys that when it's done. It's gonna be going from side to side again, like this until it looks like the mirror all right guys so this is how it looks all done i really like how it came out this is the door handle i think it matches good with the wheels because they're brushed too let me know in the comment section if you like it that's gonna be it for this video thanks a lot for watching uh, thanks a lot for 10k subscribers for all the support and y'all stay tuned for Sunday's video.